and stay down. You stay down two, and you stay down three, and you stay down four. All right. I love my sledgehammer. Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die on Alpha 20. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are now caught up with each other. That's right. The video that you guys watched today, today is the 22nd of January. It's Saturday. Um, it was the last pre-recorded video that I made. And uh, so now we are fully caught up, which is great. Um, so, however, I did do a live stream last Saturday on um, uh, the 15th for a few hours. And a few things happened during that live stream. I was planning on um, actually doing some live stream recording sessions, but um, it kind of kind of didn't work out uh, to do that. So uh, some things happened during that live stream. And if you want to see how they happened, then watch the live stream. If you haven't already, it's on my channel uh, in the live stream section. Um, <clears throat> so I'm, I don't remember exactly what happened <laughs> in that live stream, except for that we did. Uh, we got to tier four with wrecked and we made ourselves a gyrocopter. Uh, I think those are probably the most important things that happened uh, during the live stream. And then we went out and, you know, did some questing. And I, I think I got killed once or twice <laughs> uh, because it just got overwhelmed and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, if anything else real significant happened during the live stream. Oh, shit. Looks like I need to do some inventory management. Um, I don't remember off the top of my head what it was. But if I do remember, I'll point it out. But the best thing to do is go watch it because we had a really good time and... Um, some crazy stuff happened. So, okay. So let's see. The plan for today is tier four. Yeah. We're going to start some tier four questing. Let me see. Do I have any points? I don't have any points. Okay. So we're working on perception. Now we got perception up to seven and we're trying to get dead eye to four penetrator to four. Uh, no, that requires eight. Okay. Well, eventually to four, a lucky looter to four and salvage operations to four. And then once all those are at four, um, I am, it is my intention to eventually, you know, get perception all the way to 10 and then get the rest of those up to, to max out to two. But, uh, I think once we get all those to four, we'll be in pretty good shape. And then we're probably going to switch back over to strength, get boomstick up and skull crusher and 69er. So those are kind of what we're looking at uh, over the next several points. And then eventually I'm going to get into the fortitude tree and get the, you know, the bar brawling, uh, you know, hand, hand to hand combat and all that going. So that's a plan. Uh, we have more house flipper that we need to do too, of course, but, uh, we'll, uh, I'm not really kind of in the mood for doing that right now. So, um, yeah, we'll worry on that. We'll worry about that later. Okay. So yeah, just turned morning. So let me, uh, I'm going to cut the camera and just kind of do some quick inventory management. And then we're going to go see rectum and get ourselves some, tier again uh, ourselves a tier four quest and do a tier four quest what day is it? it's day 46 so we have until uh 42 49 okay so we still have, still have three more days before hard uh i don't think we need to do anything at all with the base it is as good as it's going to get uh we will probably oh my god look at all the ammo i have if only this was subsistence <laughs> i'm gonna have to make uh, some more explosives uh, if you guys haven't already checked it out, I've, I started playing subsistence and I just immediately fell in love with that game. Um, it's, I, I don't know. It's hard to explain. I, I, I've known subsistence has been around for years. You know, I knew it was there and I kind of watched a little bit of it here and there on, on YouTube. And it just, I don't know. It didn't really seem like it was that, that exciting of a game, very grindy and stuff. But then I started playing it. It was like, oh my God, this game is just crazy. Um, and so I got hooked on it and I've been playing it and I started a series. And if you guys, uh, want to watch me struggle with what is probably one of the hardest, um, but most satisfying and at the same time, frustrating survival <laughs> games out there, uh, go check out that series. Um, it's, um, between that and green hell, which at some point I need to resume my live stream series of green hell. Uh, those two are, are really, really, really good survival games. Um, the thing about subsistence, though, and is that it, it all, it's just about survival. That's all it's about. You know, there's no questing. There's no storyline. Um, you know, there's, it, it's just survive. But 
it's just really addicting, you know, at least it has been to me. So yeah, go check out that series if you haven't seen it. All right, enough about that. Let's get into seven days to die. So guys, I'm going to, um, uh, I'm going to cut the camera. I'm going to do a little bit of inventory management. I'll meet you over at Rectums and we will get ourselves a tier four quest. So see you in a bit. All right, we are here at Recti's place. Put away your weapon unless you'd like to die in my store. Grab all that stuff. Eh, maybe we'll, eh, I don't know, we'll take his skull crushers. Okay, uh, let's look at your inventory first. I don't remember if I checked him or not uh, during that live stream. So let's sell those two items to him. And let's look at his inventory engine, elixir, da, 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 great heist. Uh, that's all he's got in secret. What level are those? Not as good as what we currently have. I'm pretty sure I did look at this stuff, but like I said, we'll just look again. Uh, let's grab the acid from him. Uh, yeah, okay. A sale is a sale. Even um, if it's to a scumbag let's like go. You. Okay, so here we go. Tier fours. Um, we got a f a, some fetch and clears. They're all like far away from here, man. That sucks. Uh, all right. Let's take. Hey, jerk. You need some work. Let's do this one. House Can't Old Mansard 2. All right. So I have a couple of things in our little drop chest here. Let's add all of this to it. Um, and the acid too. There we go. Okay. Uh, you know what? I don't actually need really need the nerdy glasses. I know we'll get a little more XP, but I'd rather have the luckies on. Uh, but we do want to keep those in the bike. All right. Let's head on over. Um, seems like almost all the tier fours so far. Whoops are over in this other town. I don't know why he doesn't give me any tier fours in his own town. Unless there aren't any tier four buildings. I don't know. Maybe there aren't. I hadn't really considered that. Uh, but this is a much larger town. It's even got a Deshong Tower in it. Uh, over on this side. <laughs> All right. This is our house here. park here oh man I gotta get used to where all my shit okay I'm out of practice guys <laughs> um, go here take a bandage one around the corner heal up just a little bit okay yeah I'm a little rusty <laughs> I haven't played for a week All right, he did. Feral Egger. Yeah, don't go through the gate, dumbass. Come up to the fence where you can't get through. These zombies are so stupid. Fuck. Yeah, I am like bad out of practice, you guys. I got a laceration and everything. Son of a bitch. Okay. I my all my muscle memory and everything is set up for subsistence right now. <laughs> so I'm like just oh shit. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. As you can tell, um I still have a lingering cough from COVID. Damn cough just doesn't want to go away. Everything else for the most part I'm good on symptom wise, but man, cough. Blech. And a little nasal congestion too. Anyway, okay, so <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> Shit, I'm going to have to be really careful, you guys. I'm going to have to be really, really careful, um, or we might just die. Uh, we got a laceration, which absolutely royally sucks. Um, hopefully, we can come across a um, sewing kit to fix that. Are there any trash bags in the immediate vicinity? <laughs> There's an iron wolf over there. Here's a trash can. No, I don't want that stuff. You know, 
I've, I've been having a lot of stuttering and frame rate issues. I think we're going to have to make some uh, graphics adjustments here. Um, why don't we set everything to high? But then we're going to turn off motion blur. Uh, we'll turn off screen space, reflections, and all that stuff. That's all nice, but it's not super important. Well, let's turn off bloom, depth of field, pretty much all this shit we can turn off. Um, I do like textures to to be on high, and, and the quality of that. Reflection quality, medium. Reflected shadows are off. Shadow distance, we can make that low. Water quality. Um, well, we're not even near water, so I don't think we need to worry about that. View distance, medium, level of detail, distance, 75%. Terrain quality, grass distance, object quality. Okay, let's, let's try that and see. Yeah, that seems to help a little bit. I mean, it's still kind of stuttery, but not as bad as it was. Yeah, let's try that and see, see how that works. Okay. Uh, are we ready? With our laceration? I think so. Isn't this the house that has like the altar and the dead bodies and shit down below? Okay, where's my shotgun? My shotgun is in three. But remember that. <laughs> Shotgun's in three, magnum's in four, oh shit weapons in five, sniper's in six, crossbow's in two, and it's not even loaded. No surprise there. No surprise there. Everybody else loaded? You're not loaded. Well, not fully loaded. We're going we're gonna to need to repair you, too. And in fact, you know... Uh, yeah, let's just repair both of these now. I've got plenty of repair kits. Well, let's just repair this, too. And how about this? And how about this? And how about this? And how about this? There we go. We still have four repair kits left over. Okay. So we go up this way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is that house. There's like a satanic altar and shit down below and um bunch of dead bodies in the basement. Get out of here, Arlene. Come on, I need a sewing kit, please. That's not a sewing kit. Um, no, I don't think I'm going to grab the cement. Okay, so we drop down here. We have some friends in here, yeah. You're not dead yet? We'll die, please. <laughs> Having trouble getting headshots off on them because they're weaving and bobbing and... Doing all their thing. I guess we'll grab that for now. Ooh, it's still really stuttery in here. Well, let's just do the best we can with it. If I have to turn something else down later, I'll turn something else down later. Come on, sewing kit. It's not a sewing kit. Oh, there's an Edgar right there and a janitor. So let's get some, whoops, sneaky sneaks. Edgar, quit crawling like a dog. Have some decency. Man, I keep hitting C to crouch, and I need to be control in this game. I wish all the game developers in the whole world would have a convention, and they'd all agree on <clears throat> which keys to use for what. <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean... You know, game, similar types of games. So if it's a survival shooter type of game, everybody uses the same key for crouching. Everybody uses the same key for jumping. Everybody uses the same key for strafing. You know, that kind of thing. That's what I wish. If I was the king of the world, I would... I would uh, what do they call it? An edict? Yeah, I would do an edict to where everybody had to do that. That's what I would do. <clears throat> All right. Anyway, enough of that. Did we check this? Yeah, we did. All right, well, we have a chance for a sewing kit with all these um, garbage piles and, you know, any type of clothing stuff. 
can have them. We'll scrap that. Uh, nope, not taking any, any of that stuff. We'll take you. And let's look in this one. Nope, don't want that either. Yeah, see, when I go this way, it stutters quite a bit. What else could we maybe tone down just a little bit? Um, Let's turn that off altogether. Uh, I've never really noticed that to be a big deal in this game. Um, I mean, the graphics look good enough without it. I mean, I, I can look at this straight edge and I still hardly see any anything jagged. So we'll turn that off. Uh, let's see, what else could we do? It's still stuttering a bit. Texture quality is half. Texture filter, medium, UMA texture. Yeah, that'll make the zombies look stupid. Let's turn reflect, reflection quality to low. I'm running an old 1080 card, guys, but, you know, if you guys have been looking at video cards on the market, um, they are super expensive right now. And the 1080 itself sells for about twice as much as I originally paid for it because people are still using them. It's a good card, but, you know, it's still an older card, so... Terrain quality is high, grass distance. Let's turn that down, though. That shouldn't be affecting us indoors. All right, we'll try that. That's better. Okay, when I run towards these sleeping bags, it's not stuttering anywhere, nowhere near as much as it was. Okay, so let's run with that. Well, hello, Zombos. Come on up the ladder and we'll just send some... <laughs> we sent him all the way down to the bottom. That's funny. Oh, now you can't get on the ladder, can you? That was funny, man. Is this a clear... Yeah, this is a clear, so we got to kill those guys. Uh, let's get the Magnum out. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. All right, let's go. Nothing in there. Check the medicine cabinet and the toity. Yeah, we'll take, yeah, I'll take both of those things. I should probably be wrenching radiators too for brass and all that, so let's do it. Nothing behind there. We have to go uh, down below anyway, so... Whoops. We'll just take care of those dudes when we get down there. Um, nope. I was hoping to get a, a thingamadoodle kit from there. Grab all that stuff. Uh, crouch? There. Uncrouch. Nobody's in there? Oh, some something's in there. We'll take that. Looks like we have to go out the door. Let's check the sink for acid and all that. Nah. I'm not gonna grab that stuff. Okay, let's go out the door. And... Oh, shit! Now we're infected. Um, I think I have stuff in the bike for that, so. <laughs> Out of her fatigue, too, man. I'm just, I'm really rusty, you guys. Really rusty. That's probably not a good thing, because tonight, or no, yeah, tonight, um, we're going to start a live stream series on the channel. Yeah, I guess we'll scrap that. Where we're going to... Play on. We're gonna play on insane uh, 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 nightmare in the wasteland. We have, and the rule is that we have to live in the wasteland. So yeah, that's gonna be fun. And with me being so out of practice, it's not that doesn't bode well for me, huh? By the time you guys watch this video, it'll be uh, the day after. But you'll you can always watch the bod too if you can't watch it live. So, uh, all right, this door is unlocked. 
I'll take that because it sells for a lot. And I guess, oh, come on, sewing kit. Ah, oh, yeah, we, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, that takes care of that ailment. And, um, are we supposed to go out here? I don't think, I don't think so. Why is the light pointing at that? I don't know. Uh, we came, did we come through? Yeah, we need to go this way. Into here. Break all of these. We got three zombs. And stay down. You stay down two, and you stay down three. And you stay down four. All right. I love my sledgehammer. It is a thing of beauty. Check in here. Another sewing kit. Beautiful. And some stuff to sell and another sewing kit. I'll take it. So, yeah, eight. Key eight. I'll grab this too. What the hell? Let's grab this too. Uh, okay. And how about this? Alright, we'll go through here. We got ourselves, um, another... Yeah, there's like hospital beds in this house. They were doing some freaky stuff in here, man. Experimenting on people and who knows what else. I don't think I even want to know what else. Alright. So, what's up here? That door is locked. And now we have a puppy trying to get into the house. Do these things give brass? Brass candlesticks? They do! Nice. Trying to see if there's like a a running horror or something going on outside. We should probably take one of these. Get away from me. Alright. We have one dude trying to break to here. We got an irritated vulture. Of course, vultures are always irritated, right? I don't think there's such a thing as a non-irritated vulture. All right, I'm gonna set this down. Oh, no, I'm not. Okay, never mind. Let's just get her done. Come on, Edgar, break the door. He's a feral Edgar. Takes a couple whacks. Um, let's get little friend out because I'm a little concerned about that wolf, particularly if it's a dire wolf. All right. Let's just put, block that to buy us a, a little bit of time if we need it. Someone coming around this way? I think so. Yep. Alright, that takes care of Mr. Wolf. Uh, let's grab our hammer. You know, since we're gonna go outside, we might as well... We might as well drop a few things off in the bike whilst we're at it. Let's do it. Uh, where is our bike? It's over this way. <clears throat> and uh, we can also take a antibiotic while we're down here too. All right, let's grab one of these and then load up anything. We're not going to take that. 
I guess I'll keep the iron just because we're going to keep getting it as we wrench stuff. Um, let's drink this now. Oh, that stuff can go in there. Candles? Oh, we got those from the candles. Yeah, let's take those for the house. Maybe we'll do something with those in the house. And that is it. The bike is full. <laughs> okay, we're not... Uh, let's grab these radiators. These uh, single stack of radiators. Because we'll probably get some more of those. And yeah, I think we're good. Okay, are, uh, are all of our ailments taken care of? I believe they are. Do I have some extra bandages in here? No, but I have this and this, so we will make some extra bandages. Recipes, first aid bandages. There we go. That'll get us back to a full stack. Um, I'm going to take one of the... Well, we only have... Can I drink beer without getting... I think I can drink this without getting stamina regen. It doesn't say that it gives us any hydration, so maybe it doesn't. I don't know. Well, here, let's just drink this. And let's take this, one of these. We're going to be a little bit thirsty, but not unbearably so. Okay. And that frees us up two more slots in here. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. We came out over on this side. Chicken. And we were working our way through here. But I heard if we uh, heard a zombie coming. Grab that. Shotgun shells. Grab this. And what the hell? Let's grab this too. Get some uh, mechanical parts from these things. Okay. I'm not going to grab these couches. I could, but I've got over a full stack of leather back at the base, so I think we're okay on that. Yeah, I know I should use my blade, but I'm too damn lazy right now to switch over. Okay, so what's in here? Which way are we supposed to go? Out here. Oh, this is a side room. That's right. Yeah. Um, but it looks like it does lead to the same place. Okay, so let's grab this. Uh, yeah, then we'll take that to sell it. Sure, why not? Oh, shit. That's a lot of Zeeks, man. All right, let's let him take the door down. I'm sitting here waiting for them to break the door down, and I'm just like going, no, nope, come on, guys, let's get on with this. Let's get on with this, man. Dead bodies and coffins and workbenches in the garage. Pretty disgusting, man. Pretty disgusting. Get some plastic out of there and a green wrench. Then we'll sell that sucker. Um, is there stuff up here? Yeah, there's a box up here. Oh, yeah, there is stuff up here. Okay, let's um walk up here and then come over to here. Um, I'll take that. Oh my gosh, nails. Nails are the most precious thing in subsistence. But in here, in this game, nah, we can make more. <laughs> Alright, let's jump down. We got a trash thingy up here. And sure, we'll get some plastic. All right, let's do a little bit of wrenching and then we'll continue on. I didn't really need our main to take that.
I guess we could, we could get a decent amount of plastic and stuff from those dead bodies, but... Eh. I might come back later and do it. We'll see. Okay, I'm thinking that probably what happened was the Zombos just broke through a pathway that we weren't meant to go on, maybe, or something. I don't know. We are in the kitchen. I don't really want any of that stuff. Yeah, let's go. Beautiful. Edgar, here. I have an axe. Boys. gonna say something snarky but <laughs> I just my my brain just all of a sudden decided to take a nap uh, all right let's grab this no nope. eight key eight see I'm gonna by the time I'm done with this episode I'm going to be all muscle memory is, is all gonna be back to seven days to die and then I'm gonna go play subsistence and get eaten by a bear you just watch it's gonna happen it's gonna happen What's in here? Oh, that's our satchel. We need that. Uh, can we just grab it? Oh, there we go. Okay, we got that done. I have my shovel with me, right? Um, yes. You need a shovel to get out of this place at the end. Uh, okay, we gotta go... Wait, how the hell do we get out downstairs now? I just saw the stairs somewhere. Going down there. I mean, we could jump down that way, but let's go down legit. <laughs> I'm completely turned around. Where the hell are the stairs at? Oh, here they are. Okay. Here they are. Zombos. I've come to play. See, this is the creepy altar room. Oh, shit. Is it just you? All right, we can handle you. Come on, bruh. Get. All right. Check the workbench. Um, Is there anything back here? This. Okay, I think there's a couple things in here we wanted to look at. I'm going to drink this. Yep. Ooh. Well, hopefully whatever's behind there, we can get to it somewhere else, because that's 10,000 hit points. I'm not going to spend any time breaking that sucker open. Um, all right, let's let's wrench the, the workbench here. So... I think we've had this conversation before. Um, but I'm not the kind of player that wrenches every single thing and loots every single thing. You know, um, it's mostly... Oh, we didn't loot this. It has to do with time, you know, and when I'm, when I'm actually recording the video, it has to do with not boring you guys too much with looting every single thing and wrenching every single thing. But, um, you know, there's certain things I'll pretty much always get, unless I miss it on accident. 
but I know there's some of you guys out there that do loot every single thing and you know waste not want not and I get I get that uh, I, I do get that but that's not me you know I, I'm gonna just I'm gonna loot certain things certain things I'm not gonna loot sometimes I'm I might loot something sometimes I might not it just kind of depends upon how much time I have trying to keep you guys entertained Ooh, nice we got a, a thing there and you know that kind of thing so just kind of keep that in mind and if you are one of those people that thinks I should be looting everything it's not gonna happen so you'll just have to get used to that sorry <laughs> it's just the way it is just the way it is um we need to make some room here so let's scrap that and uh, I don't think I'm gonna run into any more radiators down here so I'm gonna scrap just this single one to free up a spot Um, let's scrap this. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, we can go ahead and just drink that. So that gives us another spot there. Okay. Did we check in here? Yeah, we did. But let's, let's wrench this. And, you know, there's, there's other days that I'll... I'm, I'm more in, you know, kind of a, in a looting uh, and salvaging mode and other days when I just want to get into the action. So I can't really say if there's an exact rhyme or reason to it. It's just the way that it is. So <laughs> now that we got that out of the way. All right. Uh, we check that. Uh, apparently you can get acid from these things if you read um, one of the books. It might be like the Wasteland book, maybe? Wasteland Treasures. Yeah. Um, adds a chance to harvest acid from cars and medical equipment. Um, so, obviously, we don't have that. So, pretty sure... Oh, I guess that was unlocked. I'm pretty sure we, we couldn't, you know, get that at the moment. All right, let's check these guys. We find gasoline in a biohazard drum. That's always been interesting. Yeah, there's a lot of bodies that you could come down here and harvest. There's going to be a bunch of Zeeks inside this. Oh, there's one right there. Uh, inside this thing here. Why don't we do this? Let's grab, or no, we don't need to do that. Let's grab this. Wake up, Zombos. Oh shit, that, did, <laughs> that didn't do much. Oh my god. Run, 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 run. I gotta get behind the door. Oh. We might need a little friend for this. That's a lot of Zika Roos. They're all feral too. So tough as hell. Whoa. See what's in here. Oh, nice! Look at that. Wow. Um. Okay. Scrap this. Very, very nice loot there. Um. Let's just eat this straight up. Uh, we do want the nine mils. So what's going to have to? Oh, yeah. We have a full stack of nine mils already. Uh. Sacrifice one piece of leather. I think what we're going to have to do is go back to the bike and try and offload a few more things before we get the fat loots because we have no room. Yeah, we don't give a shit about that. Okay, we are done with the quest, um, so we just need to do the fat loots now. Um, guess we'll scrap that. You know, I don't know, man. I might actually come back here and harvest all this. I don't really, I'm not, I don't really care so much about the, the spoiled meat because I don't even think we're going to do a garden in this series. We might still, but, but the plastic would be worth grabbing for sure. All right, let's get back up here. You know, and we do, we do have plastic in here, don't we? All right, you know what? I'm going to grab it really quick.
All right, I just realized I'm not really getting that much plastic um, from those, so screw it. Let's just go. I'm not grabbing the bones either. I got over a full stack of bones back at the base and plenty of glue and duct tape. Uh, we want that, and I guess we'll take that, and let's get the brass from these lamp posts. Our lamp candle candlesticks. Why would why did the hell did I call those lamp posts? I don't know. Who knows what happens in my brain sometimes. All right, um, let's break on through to the other side here. And um, I'm gonna dig my way out to the bike, drop a few things off, and then I'll meet you guys back here. For the fat loots. Okay, let's get to the fat loots. Um, I'm gonna actually, since this is a level four loot stash uh, or a tier four, I'm gonna take some eye candy. We already have our luckies on. Uh, all right, so let's see what we get here. I'm gonna break open you first. Okay. Uh, let's do the ammo pile. Pretty deep. Man, 201 bucks shot. That's very generous. And we're out of space again. Yay. Scrap that. Um, all right. Let's see what's in in here. Maybe we can consolidate a little bit. Um, wow, nice. Uh, do we need to eat? Yeah, let's just eat that straight up. Um, and we'll just drink this straight up. And we don't. We don't need one potato. Actually, no, we do need one potato. Um, nice. SMG autos. Autos turret thingamadoodle. Nice. All right. I'm going to have to leave those there. Uh, I do want the potato because we can make sham chowder, and I haven't been having to buy potatoes. All right. Well, let's just open this up and see what's in, and then I'll figure out the how I'm going to get the rest of it home. Oh, guess who left his lockpicks at home? That was really smart OG. Oh, oh. that's 10,000 hit points oh shit oh man all right so the question now is what time is it 15 you know what it's gonna take me longer to go all the way home grab lock picks come all the way back than it is just to break it so let's just break it And boom. All right. What do we got? Oh, nice, man. Lever act, a purple lever action rifle. That's a beaut. Um, all right. So we need to, uh, we're going to leave one piece of cloth here. We just don't care about one piece of cloth. I'm going to turn, wait a second. Does it take two things of cloth to make a bandage? It does. Um, here, I don't need 11 of those. Let's grab the rifle. All right. Let's see what he has for us. You're not bringing counterfeit. Wipe that smirk off your face. Uh, tactical assault rifle. Got a it. green one. Don't we have, already have a better one of those back at the base? I don't remember. That does 49 damage. This does, oh, this does a lot more damage, but it's, yeah. Um, okay, hold on a sec. What am I? Uh, yeah, I think we're going to take the steel yeah, chest armor. I'm going to have to pay you now that you did it. Oh, it's not as good as what we're wearing, though. It's got better crit resist. Interesting. Um, all right. That's worth 1091. That's worth they're both worth exactly the same. All right, well, let's take the tactical just in case I don't have one, but I'm pretty sure I have one, and I think it's even better than that, but maybe not. Um, and then let's sell a couple things to you. Uh, so we're gonna sell all of these schematics. Um, that needs to be repaired before we sell it. Uh, we'll sell all the moolahs there. And yeah. Don't let the door hit you on your way out. Let's repair that and then sell that to him too. 872. That's pretty good. 
Pretty good coin. Pretty good coin. All right, I think we're going to keep the rest of our stuff for now. All that damn gawking it goods and, and that's all you buy? Let's get, uh, it doesn't really matter. They're both in the same city. Um, we could try a night quest. Oh my God. Look how far away those are though. Nah, let's not do that. Let's just grab this one. Blockhead. Downtown I'll building three. Oh, that's going to be fun. Okay. All right, you guys, that is it for this episode. That was fun. Uh, I managed to not die. So, you know, there's a, there's that, right? <laughs> There is that. Let's grab um, as much of this stuff as we can and put as much of that stuff in here as we can. And uh, let's just do three more items in there. And we got it all. Nice. Very nice. I don't have to come back. All right. I'm going to go home, do some inventory management, and then in tomorrow's episode... We might go do the tier four, or maybe we'll do some house flipper. Yeah, maybe we'll do some house flipper. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, you know what to do. Hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you have, thank you very much. Appreciate it. Uh, take a look at the join button, too, by the way. I do have a membership program. I did change it up. It's now two tiers. Um, a tier one membership allows you to play on our multiplayer servers. Tier two membership gives you a couple of additional perks. So, take a look at that if you're interested in being a member of the Old Guy Gaming channel. And have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.